The arts in Conway are a way of getting the word out about what a great little town we have here for people to come see. The arts are our hook to draw people into Conway. And then when they come here, they realize that there's a lot going on in the city of Conway. Because this is a blossoming artist community, and we're just trying to recognize it here. It was so important to have Gullah culture and the Gullah history become a part of the Waccamawneck, Ory County, and specifically Conway. Because this area owes a lot to the Gullah people and its development, its, its growth, its history. I thought it was important that that chapter in this history have a place in this town. We have um, lots of different kinds of art here. We have um, art by Diane Britton Dunham, who is an artist that's self-taught and a Gullah from Louisiana. Arian King Comer. Arian's work is specifically important because Arian has reassociated us with indigo. Indigo at one time was the big crop here in the Carolina colony. And we also have doll makers. We used to make dolls out of uh, corn silk and moss and things like that. And these women have brought those old practices together and they're now making dolls that are featured nationally. We have, of course, the infamous sweetgrass baskets. Having Gullah spotlighted here in the Grand Strand is my way of telling people that we're everywhere. I uh, would call myself a whimsical folk artist. Um, I think of my style is um, bright, and um, I try to keep myself cheerful and um, my artwork cheerful because I think people are happier when they see happy art. We have done wonderful here. The people in Conway have been um, open arms and they have um, really enjoyed uh, seeing lots of uh, different styles and, and the different genres of artists that have come in has been wonderful. And so they've been very, very much open arms to the whole idea. Conway has um, a lot of potential for being an art community. Um, the old town feel, uh, it really attracts artists. Uh, the art scene in Conway is definitely growing. Uh, when I opened my gallery about a little over two years ago, I was the only artist here and now we have four. So we're, we're growing very quickly here in Conway. Um, I started my uh, series of Conway, historical pieces in Conway about three years ago. And that is what led me back here, back home to open my gallery. I'm a steel sculptor. I'm a, I'm a, I do welded steel. I, um, I take fine objects, mostly fine objects pieces, and uh, sometimes structural steel, and combine them into shapes and forms, mostly abstractions. Our goal is to train, we train mostly at Coastal um, graphic designers, and we have a good teacher education program. My desire is to have a space, a place like this, that students could come in and just produce art. Um, we want to train artists. Right now we service the uh, teaching community and uh, the design community and we do, I think Coastal does a, a good job. The Main Streets all get together and talk about when's the road show coming to our town and what we can do to make it better. And the goal of Main Street USA is to help downtowns become revitalized. Downtown is really where many people in Conway get their identity from. 